My name is Ryan Jamal Swain. I'm an actor, activist, um, singer, dancer, and I'm on Pose. So there was a time when I was about seven uh, where my mom, she was meeting this, I guess, I guess this man and you know, this father figure at the time because my mom and my father had separated. And I was dancing, you know, I was doing tap and ballet in the daytime. And then in the evening, I would go to football practice because I was like, I was a Southern kid. So it's just like, you know, we all play sports in the South. Um, and I found, I found it a little jarring that this man was, you know, supporting me at my football practices, taking me to my football games, and not supporting me in, I guess, how I was trying to express myself through dance. It chips away at the child when they think that a great wrong is being done by them um, simply because they're trying to express themselves. So there were instances in which I was like, I don't want to go to dance anymore. I just want to, you know, um, go play football because I was trying to appease um, someone, trying to appease the, the, the notion or the idea of me instead of really honing in on who I was. There's a space in which your biological family, sometimes there's a pressure of trying to fit into these molds of who they have you to be or who they think you are. And then your chosen family allows you to break all of that. I, th I think the, the notion of chosen family and the notion of community that we decide to explore in the show as well as, you know, in, in I guess in our own personal lives is very, very important. When I read the script and I got a whiff of who Damon was, it was almost a little. It was almost a little scary because there was a moment where I felt like I was reading pages out of my, my my diary. Damon is such a special character in the sense that he, you know, acts first, thinks later. He's just a very impassioned individual, a passionate human, and that's what we both share. I, I think having the opportunity to do a great thing um, with a character like Damon. This is what aligns with who I am as an artist, you know, standing on the front lines of social change and making sure that I'm doing the work that is going to forward the progression of making us a more inclusive world. There was, there was a moment where, I think on one of our first days on set, when we were all, I think it was one of the ball days, the ball scenes, where I was looking around at each and every one of my castmates, and the girls in particular, and I was like, I, I was overcome with emotion because what, a space and what an honor to you know share this very momentous moment for all of us but especially for them now it's their turn you know it's it they're they're rightfully getting their due and then just being able to be a part of that knowing that a lot of what now is the gay rights movement was started by women and trans women of color and you know just trans women in general and knowing that we're telling the story right I want you to understand that you are more than enough. Everything that you're going through is necessary, is, is, is needed to, for you to come out at the, the end of your journey, at the end of your life. I love you. I love you for trying to understand the things that make you you because that is the first steps in what it means to be a really, really powerful individual. I want you first to hug yourself, Tell yourself that you are more than enough. You are unique beyond compare. You're powerful beyond measure. And you are centered in your love. I love you. The world needs you. I'm Ryan Jamal Swain, and it gets better.